Hello everyone, it's me Liz, and today, today, <laughs> why did I say like that? Hello everyone, it's me Liz. Today we have another what I eat in a day. But to put a fun twist to it, I am gonna go vegan for a whole day. I've never done that before, so I don't know how it's gonna go, but I know it's gonna be fun. That is 100% guaranteed. Just like my last what I eat in a day, I've already planned out all of my meals, all the foods and delicious recipes that I'm going to try. So it's gonna be a good day. Thankfully this time, I don't have to reach a certain amount, like 126 grams of protein. Anywho, I am very excited for this video because I've been wanting to try going vegan for quite some time now. So this is a perfect day to do it. Before we eat anything though, I am gonna go film some workout videos and I thought, why not show you guys the process? I've already gotten dressed and I'm kind of embarrassed to show you what I'm wearing underneath this because I wore this in the last video. It's the same Aritzia outfit that I wore in the last What I Eat in a Day. But I haven't worn this in a workout video yet, so that is why I'm wearing this again. But yes, I have a few workout videos to film. I've already gotten ready. This is the makeup that I kind of do when I film. Actually, this is the only makeup that I ever do. So without further ado, let's go downstairs, let's get filming, and let's go work out. <laughs> okay, so right now it is around 9.30. I'm about to film three workouts today. So it's not too bad today. Sometimes I film four to five. I try to keep it under five because after that it gets a little too tiring. I always film workout videos in bulk. So it's just a lot easier to do that. So before I start filming, I go over all the movements I need to do just to refresh a little bit and be prepared for what is up next. I usually have my laptop right here. So when I'm filming, I can see and it's very convenient. I can just like glance to the side and see all the exercises. And because you know, I do everything by myself, I make timers right here so I can see the time and I can see the exercises that are coming up next. So it's a lot convenient. Thank God for this website. It's called the intervaltimer.com. Bless this website because I use it every single time I film workout videos. It's just so I can see the next exercise that is coming up next, or else I have to memorize every single exercise. I mean, I can do that, but that's also gives more room for errors, you know? All right, I'm gonna go stretch and then we're gonna get filming. Um, done with the first one. Now we're gonna film the second one. It's the arm workout, so bam. Um, my little rolls are so cute. guys i just took a shower and mama chu cut me papaya so yeah i'm having that before i cook because i'm a little hungry i need some energy to cook um those workouts wipe me out in the best way possible and i'm excited to share them with you guys i love papayas mm. Mm. i'm not used to being vegan so it feels very normal right now. And I just had a thought like, oh my god, this is papaya vegan. <laughs> mm. Done. All right, let's go make some avocado toast with a twist. <laughs> okay, we're not doing that. <laughs> All right, friends. So we are going to make an avocado toast with tofu on top. Because, you know, I usually like eating avocado toast with a sunny side up egg. But because we are vegan today, I am eating it with tofu. I saw someone do this before and I thought, hmm. I kind of want to try it. That looks not super appetizing, but I still want to try it. Um, it's just the thought of having tofu on toast is kind of strange to me, but we're going to find out today if it's good or not. I have everything prepared right here. It's super easy. I just have a slice of whole grain bread, avocado, and tofu, the main ingredient. So let's get cooking and let's see if it tastes good.
guys it's done it looks really cute it's a little strange to me to be honest but we'll try it i almost sprinkled this seasoning on top but then i remember it has cheese in it so i cannot do that it literally says contains milk right there but let's give it a go excuse me excuse me oh you're so cute shall we oh god i'm so i'm a criminal my family's having fish eggs and delicious mapu tofu but i'm gonna have tofu an avocado. It's just such a weird combo. I don't get it. I've been bashing on this for quite some time now, so I'm just gonna try it and stop talking to see if it tastes good. It's still good, but it's not like an egg. It's very different. This is not good. I like it, Mama. This is not good. That's your because you're a pussy. Guys, the microphone was turned the other way the whole time. This happens to me too often. But yeah, I had a bite already, and it's just. It's good, but it's not like mmm factor, you know. Bye bye. Oh. Oh, good boy. I love you. I love you. Wow. You. You're so cute. Mochi can I take care of you? Okay, you no mama that cute. Look at my two little babies are together. The prince and the crackhead. The movie. Alrighty everyone, we are done with brunchy brunch brunch. And now I wanna try making it buffalo cauliflower i've been wanting to try to make this buffalo cauliflower for quite some time now so we're gonna give that a go it is vegan so it's a perfect time to make this little meal little snack i'm gonna clean up and we're gonna get making get cooking get whipping get baking i don't know let's just go all right you guys let's start making the buffalo cauliflower i have the cauliflowers right here the buffalo sauce some flour garlic powder Measuring stuff. The only non-dairy, dairy-free milk that I have is this matcha almond beverage from Trader Joe's. Yeah, it's matcha. I don't know how this is gonna turn out, but I think it'd be fine. Like the matcha is so light, you can barely taste it. It just tastes like normal almond milk. So I'm pretty sure it'll be fine. But yeah, I got everything here, ready to be baked, and I'm very excited. It should be very easy, so hopefully idiot proof. Let's get bacon. Okay, so we need a little bit of oil just to get this going. Okay, I think that should be good. And then we're gonna toss in our flour. Look at this flour, it's so cute. But yeah, we're gonna toss in our flour, then our garlic powder, and then we're gonna mix this together. It's very interesting, just toss it around. Oh, I made a mess already. Oh, we need to coat it really evenly, I see. Get in there, you. Out of the way, you. Out of the way, you. Okay, so I dipped all of the cauliflower into the buffalo sauce. The sauce is so strong, like my nose is just filled with that pungent smell. It smells really good though, so I'm not complaining. But yeah, I coated it with lots of barbecue sauce and now I'm gonna bake it for 15 minutes and it should be ready. Guys, look at them. They're so adorable. Oh my goodness, I am so excited to try these. Guys, look at this. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. It smells really good too. It looks so yummy. I cannot wait to try them. Let's see how these taste. I've been waiting for such a long time. Oh, it's soft. It's so soft. I don't know what I was expecting. All right, the moment. Oh, oh my God, it's falling. The moment of truth. Mmm. Wow. That tastes really good. Queena, do you want to try these buffalo cauliflower? Our next guest is, drum roll. Come here. Ooh. Sit down. It looks so scary. <laughs> You're too tall. Come here, You're gonna be a guest star on the show. Okay. It tastes kind of like a wing. It's just very saucy, right? What do you think? 
I don't like the fact that it's cauliflower. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's not bad. It doesn't taste like buffalo wings. Yeah. But like, it's like a nice dish, you know? It's like a good vegan dish. I just dish. don't don't advertise it as buffalo chicken. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would just be like, oh, buffalo cauliflower. Yeah, know? yeah. Like, it would be good as is. Just don't say buffalo chicken. Yeah, like there's you no meat You know how they like quote it sometimes at <laughs> the restaurant? Chicken. <laughs> Like, no, it's just cauliflower. <laughs> it's cauliflower. How high would you rate it for out of 10? Um, I'm gonna do five out of five. Okay, so since it's like being advertised as like buffalo chicken, like yeah. I would give it like. No, I was gonna say it's about three. We're just gonna say it's buffalo cauliflower yeah, in this house. But like, you know, Still if three. you advertise it as like cauliflower, I would give it like a four. Okay. And just be like, oh, it's delicious. Yeah. Because it's cauliflower. <laughs> just you know? admit that it's cauliflower. <laughs> it's okay that it's cauliflower. <laughs> just admit it. Thank you for rating this. No problem. All right, so that was Queen's rating. That was pretty good. This is just cauliflower, you know. It's not really a replacement for buffalo wings. But, you know, I would say it's like a four. It's pretty good. All right, I'm going to save this for later. Maybe someone else will want to eat it too. Maybe Mama Chew. Okay, you guys, this came in the mail today. I ordered it a few days ago, and I'm so excited it's finally here. I've been wanting these for so long, so I'm super excited to try it. My go-to everyday eyeshadow palette broke, so I just got another one. And this little brush, because I've been wanting it for a while. It's like perfect. It's like a big fluffy powder brush and a small one. So perfect for, you know, concealer, all that. Also, I want to show you guys something that the brand by Humankind sent me. They sent me a little kit of personal care, and they are just so adorable. They sent me some deodorant, toothpaste, it's like a little kit right here, floss, and also mouthwash. And when I opened these, guys, let me tell you how excited I was because they're so cute. Like, look at it. It's so simple, so minimalistic, so clean, and they're just very adorable. Everything about their brand is very environmental friendly. They really focus on reducing single-use plastic. So everything here you can use obviously over and over again. Like look at this mouthwash right here. You can use it many times. And also for this, this is a toothpaste. Have you seen toothpaste like this? It's so interesting. The toothpaste is in here in this little paper baggie. They also sent this along in the package. And look what it says. This note card will disappear in water in moments. Single-use plastic will take 1,000 plus years. It's just really adorable. Like everything about this brand is so environmental friendly they care so much about the environment and you can obviously see on their website they're very huge advocates of that but yeah i just want to show you guys because they're so freaking cute why are their packaging so cute i cannot like look at this everything is just so minimalistic and i'm living for it oh my gosh i cannot cap it with one hand these colors oh and this floss too like i've never seen a floss like this that's so unique. The packaging is so unique. Thank you by Humankind for sending me this very amazing and environmental friendly personal care kit. I cannot wait to try it. Oh my god, they're so cute. Look at this. Hello you guys, it is dinner time and today I am making a barbecue cauliflower pizza. This is my first time ever making pizza. We jumped from making burgers to pizza. I maybe should have stopped that pasta halfway, but you know what? I've made pasta before. So I thought, why not make pizza and challenge myself a little bit? I really don't know how this is gonna go because I mean, pizza is not the easiest thing you can make, but I think it'll be fine. I'm following a recipe from Pickup Limes. I love her channel. She is amazing. I've been watching her for so long now. She has so many delicious, yummy vegan foods. So if you're vegan, if you want to try new recipes, then check out her YouTube, her website. But yes, this recipe is by her. I'll be using it today. I have the ingredients set up here. I'm going to start by making the dough, the pizza dough. So yes, we're starting from scratch. Let's just hope this goes well, guys. Pray for me and let's get cooking.
this is so ugly. You guys, I've been making this pizza for almost two hours now, and we are finally done. Oh my, oh my. I'm not gonna lie, that was, that was hard. Well, it wasn't hard, it was just very tedious. I mean, I had a lot of fun, but it was just a lot of steps. So the pizza is done, it's so beautiful. But the thing is that it's really hard. I baked it for too long, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, it just, it's so hard. It's more like a cracker. <laughs> and excuse the background noise, my mom is cooking right now. So I'm just gonna sit here and enjoy my pizza. But damn, this thing looks good though. I'm very proud of myself. This is monumental, I must take a picture. Okay, you know what? I look kind of bald. I'm gonna take my hair out. <laughs> oh, guys, oh, my brain is freed. Let's just give it a try. Oh my gosh. This is so good. Whoa. You guys, it's so good. Mm, the yogurt sauce. It's everything, that is so bomb. And the barbecue cauliflower, bomb as well. The flavors blend so seamlessly together. Thank you, Pickup Limes, you are amazing. I love you. I might cry, I might cry right now. I'm speechless. It's like heaven on earth. It's so good. This is a good day. I'm so glad we made this. I feel like I'm drunk off this pizza right now. I I'm not okay. In the best way possible. I'm completely drunk off this. So good. That was delicious. All right, guys. It's already nighttime. I am still so full from the pizza. I ate two slices, but that was so filling and so delicious. Today was a very good day. I had so much fun. The recipes are just so interesting today, and really challenge my cooking skills. I realized that being vegan really allows you to be very creative with your foods. Props to you guys who are vegan because it was not easy, but it was really fun, so I'm so glad I tried this. Also, look at this cute little t-shirt. It says A. Perfect to wear this on a day when I'm vegan. Anywho, I am done eating for the day. This is gonna be the end of the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I had so much fun cooking with you guys and just hanging out with you guys like always i love it it's my favorite thing to do let me know what other type of what i eat in a day you want to see i have a few of mine and i'm very excited to try them but i also want to know what you want so comment down below and let me know all right thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys very soon Bye bye <laughs> who's a cutie you guys are cuties who's a cutie you guys are cuties who's a cutie me uh, oh that was not cute